Justin, and this is Pisces Printing. So on today's little episode, we're kind of deviating from the norm, and I'm just going to actually do a little tiny video tutorial for the Ender 3 Max installing a Micro Swiss Hot End and the CR Touch. I didn't really find many guides out there specifically for an Ender 3 Max, so this is just here in case you need to know how to do this. Um, for the regulars on the channel, I'm sorry if this isn't exactly what you're here for, but I just thought it was a good resource to have out there for people. So this will just be a short little video, and the speaker number five is on its way. Um, I'm actually doing this because I was printing a piece for it and that printer failed, and I just felt like it was a good time to upgrade the printer. So yeah, we will get to that real quick, and hopefully this helps everybody.
Okay, so hopefully that little tutorial has helped you out. Um, if it did, leave a like, subscribe, it helps. Um, but yeah, I just felt that there needed to be an Ender 3 Max video on this, because there's a touch different than an Ender 3. You have to find a little bit different of firmware if you don't want to build your own. And then some of the brackets are just a touch different, and then the mounting's a little different on the actual carriage. So, yeah, I hope this video was straightforward. If there's any questions, please feel free to leave a comment below, and I will get back and I will answer them about this install. Um, I don't want anybody struggling with this. So yeah, if you're having any issues at all, please comment below and I usually respond within the day. So yeah, have a good one.